Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. On this channel, I react to the top music videos or songs you request. But, this one's a little different. I chose two songs based off the title alone. So the first one we're going to react to is I Hate It Here by Kayla and Nicole. If you don't know who that is, well you've been, but for real though, um, she is a personality on YouTube. Probably more than that, Instagram as well. I think she was known. Well, no, let me not say was. I think she is known originally for her like really thin ponytail but first let's start it with i hate it here Love bombing, the action or practice of lavishing someone with attention or affection, especially in order to influence or manipulate them. Huh. Huh. This was not what I expected. Um. She went from a ponytail tutorial to a mother to a singer. Love ya. Laughing emoji. Heart, heart. No shame. Huh? I've lost myself in a man I can't change. Felt that. I feel like this is her moment. This was the perfect song to set the tone on where she, on who she is. It feels like a star is being born and we are all here to see it happen for her. I cannot wait for her first era and album. Listening to the lyrics, the rhythm, and the transitions makes me feel like I'm riding on the country road and hit one of those baby hills that cause your stomach to go on your chest a little. Like you can really feel the song. No, I feel it. Especially with the end where it's like, oh, this is what love bombing is. And this is what the song is basically about. And I'm like, oh. Oh, and she replied, what a description. I love people feeling their own emotions, experiences, and the true meaning of the lyrics. Like, it's not an encouragement, but the hard truth people normally run from. Friends don't always get through with their words, which usually turns to anger or no more of a relationship. But feelings always touch you sometimes in ways you don't forget. And that's what I need to do for the special person to me and many others I've witnessed in these things. Even when I feel down about some differences in my own relationship, it hits deep. The things I said, like, wow, sometimes I move myself. That's lovely. To be able to move yourself, like, damn, I did that. I wrote that. I performed that. Like, that's pretty cool. Um, 
So <laughs> if you can see a theme, I'm just choosing songs with like not necessarily negativity, but just interesting to me titles. So first is I hate it here. Next is Earth is Ghetto. Let's watch. Are you good? That was quite the twist, Dad. That was kind of... That was a twist. That, that was a twist. I love that she's singing Earth is Ghetto and she's the one that ends up driving the ship. She was driving the ship. Ooh, chop. Okay, I didn't expect that. I love a good story in a music video. So that was Earth is Ghetto by Aaliyah Sheffield. I think that's how you say her name. Correct me in the comments if you know the proper pronunciation. This song says everything my heart is feeling. I guess that's why I always cry. Well, this is a beautiful song. I love it.
great way to bring this song out in a visual form. Congratulations on moving onward and upward with your beautiful voice and meaningful work. When I came across this song three or two years ago, I thought this had, oh man, such talented people who don't get enough recognition. This lady saying exactly what I'm thinking in my head every day and I wish I lived in a world where such people were heard. And now I'm like in an alternate universe where there's an amazing video and more people get to hear this. And oh my God, it feels miraculous. Oh, well. <laughs> Well, all right. Yo, it fully, it got, yo, it fully got produced and you're on Def Jam. So dope. Happy for you. Well, I don't know. She has, it seems like she has a really big fan base. Um, she has 10K likes on this video and 44,000 subscribers. It, she's giving Jill Scott with more soul. And I really love that she's locks. Love. That's my hair really happy she has locks you know <sighs> love to see it um and i just i love her style it's very immaculate and i love music videos that feel like a story um just like with the last moves video i just watched and also this one there is a lot of imagery and storytelling um i thought originally that the little girl was the singer but you know like the young version but then she came to rescue at the end as long as well as the elder so that was a curveball I did not expect. And also, flawless. I love this. I love this very much. Very much a random thing I found because of the algorithm. And thank you, algorithm. I rather enjoyed that. You know me a little, a little, a little too well. So that's really it for today. I hope you enjoyed my twofer. Um, if you like either of these artists and you have more recommendations for these specific artists or any other artists you like, Leave it in the comment section below. I make new videos every week and as usual, stay curious my friends.